Either that, either that's ground or I'm getting hit with something. <laughs> ground. <laughs> Bye. All right, hold on. All right, let's let's calm down. <laughs> let's calm down. You said the ground. <laughs> Fish get big. We had good intel on this spot. Can't fish them all right now. You probably, I mean, you can, but it's a little more tough than it normally is right now. So we fished a lake the other day and it start, it's starting to taper off at the lake. So we, instead of just not fishing, we wanted to try and find something else. So we got some intel on a, on a river and, uh, and it's normally, even in the greatest conditions, it's pretty tough. So, but we, we decided to take a chance and we've kind of stuck to the, the uh, big streamer game just cause we know the potential and that's honestly what we love doing. So that's how we're gonna fish. Now yeah, we'll see how it goes. A good update would be if they didn't cut anything. Besides and when I say we, I'm talking about me, myself, and I. Jay has caught a good rainbow. Warren caught a white fish. And I have not cut. I have not caught anything. <laughs> Haven't caught a thing. Oh man. How do you feel about this fish? Well, it's a white fish on the swing. <laughs> <laughs> Well, first whitefish on the swing ever. Ever. <laughs> I bet you that's why I couldn't hook him. <laughs> that makes sense now. Yeah. Nice, dude. Oh my gosh. That's funny. It's a good size whitefish, though. Off the swing. Well, we're catching whitefish. Fish. First whitefish on the swing. We're catching fish. <laughs> we're catching fish. <laughs> That was cool though. I mean, he fought pretty hard. Not bad. It's not what I was hoping for. A lot of work. Yeah, a lot of work for that. A lot of work for that. Yeah, here. Thanks. Like all these mayflies on the water, a scanty setup. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. I don't have one though. Swung this whole run. I had a few grabs. I thought they were like small rainbows because um, they're typically pretty slashy at your streamer when you're swinging like that, but. I think it was just whitefish the whole time and they couldn't get it in their mouth and then that one finally finally was able to eat it which I mean it was still cool I mean we're on the board so
know, my leader's in the my leader's in the rod though. Extend, can you extend your arm? To the right. To the right. Extend it. Extend it. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. You're good, you're good, you're good. I know, I know. Alright, bring it to the right. There you go. Yes, sir. Hey. Yes, sir. Let's go, dude. <laughs> Let's go. I told you. I told you you'd be slapping my hand, bro. I <laughs> oh, dude. I said I had a good feeling. Oh, oh my God. It's a nice fish. We've been fishing for like six hours. Oh my goodness, dude. We just got off the river like 30 minutes ago. It was a really long day. Uh, we didn't record very much on the last half. It just got really slow, kind of repetitive. Uh, not much was happening in the last half of the day, but uh, we, uh, we managed to come through. We weren't really sure what was gonna happen. Like we said a million times, that river's just, uh, you can't really predict what's gonna happen. But uh, we managed to get a nice, really nice brown. Super happy with it, made the day, I think. And uh, Warren, it wasn't on camera, Warren caught his first uh, fish on a spay rod ever. He, he was just learning to cast it today, so that was cool. Just as soon, like it was one of those one of those days, one of those rivers where it's like you you find you don't think it's gonna happen, but if you just keep casting and keep trusting your your abilities and your your gear, uh, all of a sudden, bang, freaking big brown came up and ate. Yeah, appreciate you guys watching and follow along with the runoff series, I guess if that's what we're gonna call it. Uh, till next time. Peace. Peace.